Hi right, students, let's look at question 10. Question 10 is indeed a challenging question. Why? Because of part 2, not part 1. So let's look at part 1. They say find the sale price of the crockery at retailer A. So when we see discount, right? It means this thing is sell at a cheaper price. So this is very relevant to our daily life because when you buy something, when you see something discount, if you don't know what is it about, then you won't be able to calculate what, what is the price that you need to pay. So this is a very important concept for you, even in your daily life. So the usual price is one, two, six. And for part one, I need to calculate what is the sale price after the discount. So sale price means after the discount. So that means after the discount, it will be 90%, cost 100 minus 10% will be 90%. So 90 over 100 times 126, this will give me the sales price in retailer A. So retailer just means that it's a particular store that sells it. So A and B, that means two different stores. So 113.40 cents. So this is the price for retailer A. So now for part two, this grandma claimed that the crockery cost 20 cents cheaper in A as compared to B. So do you agree with this grandma? And sure you're working to explain your answer. So let's look at retailer B. What does this mean? 8% plus 2% discount. Does it mean that it's 10% discount in total? No. This means that, for this case, it means that first, there's an 8% discount. So I calculate 8% discount, which is 92% over 100 times 126. So after the discount, the discounted price will be at 92%. So I calculate 92% first. So this one will be 115.92. So plus 2% means, right, 2% of the new discounted price. So it will be 98% over 100 times 115.92, which is equals to... 113.6016. When I round off to the nearest 10, you will be this amount. So if you compare the price, 113.40 cents, 113.60 cents. So you can agree that, yes, I agree with the grandma because. Retailer A sells at 113.40 cents, which is 20 cents cheaper or less so than 113.60 cents at Retailer B. Okay, so there's a shortcut. So the shortcut will be taking like two over hundred times maybe take one to six times ninety two over hundred. It's the same as writing 92 over 100 times 1 to 6. Then I multiply with 98 over 100. This will also give me 113.6016. Why? Because this part here is step 1. And I'm taking this new value here. 
and to find out the 98%. So if you have questions, you can ask me again immediately to clear your questions immediately. Okay, so for such questions, right, it has a similar concept as when you go to a place to use a service or eat. There's this like service charge of 10% followed by a 7% discount. This concept here is similar. So when we see a service charge of 10% and 7% GST, it doesn't mean that it's 17% in total. It means you first calculate the 10% service charge first, then you use this new price, 10 times, then you include 7% GST. So if you are unsure, what do I mean? Look at the next video. Thank you.